Well, there really is nothing like a trip out on an old-fashioned steam train. And today, we're taking a very special journey back in time. We're en route from Paynton to Kingsweir to celebrate 50 years of the Dart Steam Railway Company. And I'm delighted to say we're joined now by Barry Kogar. How does it feel to be marking 50 years? Absolutely marvellous. I can't believe it. It's flown by. I had a job and hobby in one. And it was so pleasing. I've managed to get 20-plus people who actually work with me in 73 74 people can remember steam trains they pass it on to their children and it's unique it's unique and we've got to keep things going and it's pleasing there are a lot of heritage railways all around the country some are struggling a little bit but i'm glad to say this one is doing exceptionally well okay barry thanks so much for joining us and enjoy your day Thank well there's you. all sorts of fascinating people on board today and i've been catching up with some of them who have really interesting stories to tell about their family connections to the railway going all the way back to 1973. My dad, Bob Saunders, founded both the South Devon Railway and the Dartmouth Steam Railway as well. And um, so very proud of him. This is a wonderful day of celebration of people that were here back then and all that they did for this railway. It ran right up until the end of December 72 and ran again on the first day of 73. So it was a continuous effort by everybody to keep this wonderful railway going. It's grown now to all the boats, a real family affair, and steam is in our hearts. In 1969, I was a volunteer before that, and then 1973, when he took over this line, I was the first fireman on the, the first service train, which was uh, about half past three in the morning start, and the first train was half past seven. It's just fantastic and what makes it so special is the company itself and it's fantastic that it's lasted so long and please God another 50 years as well. Well it's been a thoroughly enjoyable day taking a trip through sunny South Devon and down memory lane and all thanks to the power of steam. Sam Blackledge, ITV News.